I, I think this member just gave an excellent and powerful speech about the importance of listing the IRGC as a terrorist organization. And I know talking to communities across Canada, uh, there is wide support for this proposal. And there are many different communities who see the negative impacts of IRGC violence. Uh, the Iranian community, the Jewish community, the Iraqi community, the Lebanese community, uh, the Yemeni community, IRGC violence. Uh, actually, uh, communities in South America as well are, are now talking about how uh, the Iranian regime is spreading their violence and collaborating with authoritarian regimes in South America. Now, we're going to have a vote on this motion on Wednesday. I think that motion is going to pass based on what the opposition parties have said. We'll see what the government does. But at the end of the day, what we need is executive action or the passage of my bill C-350. It's not good enough to just pass a motion. So, so after that motion on Wednesday is voted on, and if it passes, what should we expect the government to actually do? Because a motion like this passed before, six years ago, mm -hmm. and they did absolutely nothing right. in six years. So we'll pass the motion, I hope, again on Wednesday, but we need to hold this government's feet to the fire because what really matters is whether it actually gets done. Mm -hmm.